we'll get warm. Should be warm anyway. Okay, so jogging on the spot for the first 30 seconds. And we'll just do our four normal uh, moves and dynamic stretches before we start the session. Uh, again, we'll work with a 40-20 circuit, but before that, we'll just do a bit of a pulse raiser and a little four minute circuit before we go into the hit session. So jogging on the spot for the next uh, 10 seconds or so, and then we'll go into squat with reach. So we're going to squat down and reach to the ceiling. Okay, three, two, one, feet down, squat and reach to one side, squat and reach to the other. Okay, slight rotation. Warming up the quads and the core. 15 seconds to the next move. And we'll do the same as we did on Monday. We'll do the walkouts. Five seconds and we'll begin the first set of walkouts. Walkouts, okay, straight hamstrings and then in and then up, chest out, shoulders back. Okay, I'm just gonna let one more go in. Here we go, Sam. Sam's in. Okay, so we're just continuing the warm up. We've got another 15 seconds of uh, walkouts. Okay, so chest out, shoulders back. Last one, and then we'll go into your lunges with those rotations. Okay, so lunges, you're going to step forward. The leg which is forward, I want you to rotate to that side, keeping your balance a bit better than I just did. And then just twist. And me. Okay, back to jogging on the spot and jogging. Okay, again, just taking the level up a, a fraction. It is only a warm up, so we are only looking to hold around a six to seven out of 10. In seconds. Five seconds till we begin the squat with reach. Three, two, one. Squat, reach to one side, squat, reach to the other. Fifteen seconds. Five seconds to walk out, round two. Three, two, and one, walk out. Last one. And then it's lunge with rotation again. So lunge, turn to the side, lunge, turn. Okay, 10 seconds, and we're going to begin our first move. What I want you to do in 10 seconds is 10 squat for us. So from the uh, long arm plank position, Jump in and out. Let's go. Ten of them. Ten squat for us. Nice and quick now. So you want to take the level of intensity up from where that was about a seven all the way through up to around an eight to nine. Keep working. After you've done ten, I want you to do plank jacks. I want 20 plank jacks. I'm going to stack long arm plank position where you were before. Legs are going to do star jump legs. Okay and you're gonna do 20 of them. So, so far, the combination has been 10 squat thrusts and 20 plank jacks, okay? So we're just gonna run through this drill, a couple of sets, and then we'll go into your normal 40, 20s, allowing you slight recovery. But for this one, I want you to work throughout. So after you've done your plank jacks, I want mountain climbers, 30 mountain climbers to each knee. Every time one knee comes forward, that is one rep. 
So it's nice quick mountain climbers for 30. So, so far the combination is squat for us, 10, plank jacks 20, and mountain climbers 30. After you've done your 30 mountain climbers, it's high knees and that's 40. And again, each knee is one rep. So it'd be one, two, three, four, five, and so on. Obviously I'm probably ahead of most of us, but they're your first four combinations. Okay. Oh no, you're not, you're not far behind at all. Okay, so the high knees for 40 repetitions. After you've done 40, into star jumps for 50. 50 star jumps will be your fifth move. So going through these combinations again, we've got squat thrusts and we've got the plank jacks for 20. Add another 10 so you get to your mountain climbers and then you get your 40 high knees and finally your 50 star jumps. Okay, then I want you to return back to your squat thrusts for 10, plank jacks for 20 and we're going to do another set. Okay, so keep working with combinations, doesn't matter where you are, whether you're on high knees, star jumps or you're into round two, round two, beginning with those squat thrusts, yeah, take a little bit more time than the others, 10 of them, then it's 20 plank jacks, we're going to do two sets of these and then we're going to start the hit 2010s, well, we're not the 40-20s tonight, <sighs> okay, good work guys, smashing it, remember you need to go through two rounds of each, so squat thrusts, they're 10, plank jacks are 20, 30 mountain climbers, through to the high knees of 40 reps, and finally 50 big star jumps. So again, no matter where you are, just work. Whether that's the mountain climbers, or those plank jacks, the squat thrusts, or the high knees. Just work on your combination. Okay, so. 260 repetitions out and then we're going. Is everyone all right? Some people are out. Good, all coming to the end now. Into the last minute or so for all, most of us. And we got those knee easy twins, one repetition, so you can smash them out nice and quick. And then it's into the star jumps. And we're gonna do 50 of them. If you have time and you, uh, you finish, a little bit early, just take a drink on. We're going to go into the 20 tear. Uh, keep saying 2010s, 40 20s next. And uh, again, we're going to keep you at that level of intensity. So we are aiming to get that sort of eight, nine, and possibly 10 out of 10 on this round. Okay, good. Star jumps. Well done. Okay, so I'm going to stop the clock in a second. Okay, so 30 seconds till we begin. In 30 seconds time, so if anyone's still got those last few reps, get them out. Otherwise, we're going to go into mountain climbers. So we did these earlier. We did those uh, 30 reps. But this time, I want you to go nice and quick. I know you did the first time, but really keep that up. And then I want 40 seconds flat out, okay? Then you'll hear the buzzer and that will indicate our first recovery. We're gonna do 25 exercises. I might give you a half time rest. Okay, three, two, one, mountain climbers. So really drive those knees in. First one we did in the pyramid. Now we're working in this single set. Keep working, keep working, keep working. Ignore that, keep working, keep working. Got 20 seconds left of this one. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Good, clock's back working. Okay, 20 seconds out. Next move we're going to do is Superman. Okay, so we're going to go onto the floor. We're going to have our hands and arms out. Okay, we're going to come up with both and your head's going to look up as well. So it's up and down. Up and down. Superman, so you've got to work the back. Let's go. Again, more control with this one. Don't need to go quick. 
up, reach. Keep working, 15 seconds. I don't know if I'm into you for that one. So it's there, and you're gonna look up and back down. Up and back down. Three, two, one. Okay, 20 seconds out. Okay, keeping with superheroes, we're gonna do push-ups with Spider-Man. Okay, this time you're gonna do a push-up, but then I want a mountain climber out Woods. Okay, so you're working the oblique. So you're going to bring that mountain climbers out to the side. One each side and then back into another push-up. Let's go. So full push-up at the top. Bring that mountain climber. Knee going out towards those shoulders. And then repeat. Push. Push. Okay. Spider-Man. So working the chest. And again, also working the core. Again, this might feel quite light and relaxed. We will take those levels of intensity up on the next few. So push up with that Spider-Man, one each side. Okay, we've got five seconds until we go into the fourth exercise of this drill. The next one we're gonna do is the double plank jack. So again, we did these two moves in that first pyramid. So the plank jack is one, two, but then I want the followed by the squat for us. So I want two of them as well. Then back in, okay, and continue. Again, we'll try and get as many sets of these in as possible. Okay, three, two, one, and go. So plank jack, one, two, out to the side, then in, in, and then again, one, two, in, in. Again, one, two, and in, in. Okay, so 20 seconds left of those moves. Combination is two plank jacks versus two squat thrusts. 15 seconds. Three, two, one. Okay. All right, so what I want you to do this time is one push-up. So I'll do it to the side, actually. So we'll do a push-up, and then I want you to walk laterally to one side, and then walk laterally to the next side, okay? So you can keep these push-ups nice and wide, okay? Here we go. So lateral walk with push-up. So it's push-up, and then walk as if you're in a long arm plank position, and then walk again. If you've got more room, you can do more walks laterally. You can go to one side uh, a couple of times and then back. Okay, so the uh, move we're doing is push up with a uh, lateral plank walk. Okay, so if I was here, I'd literally just swap into a position, one hand. Okay, okay. feeling that burn in the biceps, feeling it through the chest. Okay, three, two, and one. Okay, burpees up. Haven't done a burpee so far today. That's not like me. 15 minutes into the session, first burpee combination. Okay, this time with the burpee, I want you to release the hands at low points. Your chest actually does touch the floor. And then I want you to finish that burpee off. Okay, chest to floor burpees in three, two, one, go. Chest to floor, back up. Star jump. Again, you've got the option. You should be quite like to release the hands at that bottom bar. And up. Okay. Burpees. 25 seconds. Doing awesome, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six in. So burpee. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Okay, so what we did for the warm up, we did those hamstring walkouts. So again, we're gonna do the same. This time I want you to keep cutting that chest off by doing those push ups. Push up, and at the top I want one low squat into squat jump, and then repeat. Okay, we're gonna do that for 40 seconds. Three, two, one, walk out, one push up. Always is one push up, doesn't it increase? And then again, the one squat jump at the end doesn't increase. Let's go, 30 seconds. Walk out versus push up. 
and squat jump. Okay, 25. <laughs> Chest nice and low, up, in, down. Squat jump. Three, two, and one. Well done. Okay. Okay, this time it's just the one burpee. Okay, so not chest to floor, literally one burpee, but then 10 star jumps. Okay, one burpee, 10 star jumps. That's your combination in three, two, one, go. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, halfway. Three, two, one, perfect. Okay, mountain climber with commando. So let's do 10 mountain climbers. So again, long arm plank, knees coming forward for 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, And then one long to short plank. Okay, then continue, but build the commando every time. So once you've done 10 mountain climbers, one commando, 10 mountain climbers, two commandos, and keep building for the full 40 seconds. You've got 30 seconds left. Keep this intensity going. Don't stop now. Okay, so mountain climbers from long. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then that long to shore. And it's ten, then two, and so on. Okay, you've got uh, ten seconds. Yeah, good, there's the buzzer. Okay, 20 seconds, next move we're gonna do, it's just gonna shuffle from side to side, so hopefully you've got enough room to do two steps. Okay, so it's one, two, one, two. If not, it's single, it's just gonna be one, two. Okay, so shut up, side shuffles. So you're supposed to be actually touching the floor. The opposite, and every time, so. And do the same leg, arm reach. Again, if you haven't got that space, just work with that space you have. 15 seconds. Doing really well. Smashing it so far. Tenth move. This 25 minute circuit. Three, two, and one. Good. Flutter kicks we did on Monday. If you were, I think you all were. Okay, flutter kicks for this one. What we're going to do is we're going to have our hands under our head. We're going to lift our shoulders up. We're going to bring our legs nice and high. And we're going to do one leg to the floor and back. Just above the floor, sorry. So about two inches. Remember, your head and shoulders are up and you're doing flutter kicks or scissor kicks. Okay, work the core and work as hard as you can for 40 seconds. Okay, up to that high point, drop. So you're working the core. 20 seconds. Halfway. Flutter kicks. Good, well done. Okay, next one we're gonna do is sprinting on the spot. So again, nice and flat, flat out sprinting. Okay, so knees up, power with the arms and go hard. Remember, you can have a minute recovery off the back of this one. And then we're gonna do the whole circuit again. So we're gonna do all 12 stations again. All right, three, two, one, and go. So it's really quick feet, quick as you can. Earn that minute recovery.
Upway power. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good. 20 seconds. In fact, let's have a longer recovery, sorry. So ignore the next beep, have a drink, and we'll go on the next set after. Okay, so ignoring this next beep, five seconds till we go. Sorry, five seconds till that beep, but ignore it. Okay, ignore it, we've got 40 seconds. 40 seconds and then we're into the first set. Move, which we did, which was the mountain climber. So again, they're going to begin a little bit slower and then they're going to finish with that sprint at the end. I might even treat you to two sprints. Okay, 20 seconds and then we're away. So the first move we did was mountain climbers and we'll continue that. Ten seconds. Mountain climbers next, as quick as you can. Get that heart rate up if it's dropped at all. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. 40 seconds, mountain climbers, as quick as you can. Squeeze that belly button in and then drive those legs. Okay, 25 seconds on the clock. Push as hard as you can. Try and get to that buzzer, thinking that you can't give any more than you just have put in those seconds. Come on, 15 left. Again, try those knees. Keep everything nice and straight as well, so back and shoulders all in line. Work that core glute. And then obviously heart rate's gonna be massively high. Three, two, and one. Okay, so that's the, uh, next is the Spider-Man, uh, sorry, Superman, with the dorsal raise. Okay, so I'm gonna have those arms out. And then again, mind you, just go back a little bit. Okay, from there, up and reach. Up and reach. Hold it at the top for about a second and then back down. Here we go. So up and down. Twenty seconds. Halfway. Perfect. 10 seconds. And we've got five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Okay, the next one we're going to do is the push up. So we're going to have those nice wide grips. We're going to push down to the floor, and then it's that. Spider-Man uh, legs, okay, so it's to the side and to the side and then go. And once you've got the, the form, then start with pace. Let's do this. So push up with the Spider-Man legs, which is a mountain climber, out, bringing that knee towards the shoulder. And we'll do that each side, there and there. Okay, you've got 15 seconds, guys. Again, try and get as many sets in as possible. Really give that chest a good burnout. 10 seconds now. Awesome work. Got me another five, four, three, two, and one. Good. Okay, next one we're going to do is those double plank jacks and the double squat thrusts. So with them, remember, it's those one, two out legs, and then in. Okay, special combination, and it's plank jack versus squat thrust, two of each, as many sets as possible. Go, go, go. Thirty seconds. Twenty-five. You're going to fall. Remember, keep the long arm plank position. Everything nice and straight. One. Two, and then a big squat thrust in. Another one out. And that one. Okay, combination. Plank jacks, squat thrust. Got five seconds. Five, four, three, 
two, one, recover. Awesome. Okay, next one we're going to do is uh, the burpee. And again, we're going to keep the chest nice and low, touching the floor and then power up. So it's chest down, over arms away, or just pulse back up. Finish with those star jumps. Okay, three, two, one. Burpee with chest to floor. So again, working as many sets as possible. So there, arms away, power up, big star jump from the side. Got 15 seconds. <coughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Good. So it's a walk out, walk out with a push up and a squat jump. So the push up, obviously, at that far point. So here, push up, and then bringing it in for a low squat jump. Okay. Again, we'll try and get as many combinations. Let's increase the squat jump, not the push up. Okay. So we'll do one, one push up. Bring it in, and we'll do one squat jump. This time we'll do one push up, two squat jumps. And then build, okay? Keep working, building the squat jump only. Halfway. <clears throat> 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, we're gonna do those lateral walks, push-ups. Okay, so again, if you've got room, we'll do a couple of couple of walks to the side and then return it back in. So it's literally a push-up, walk across, push up, walk across, push up. I'll give you the halfway marker if you want to do more and more. Okay, so just trying to get an even distribution one way and the other. Okay, whether that's forwards or the other, whatever. Okay, doing awesome guys, keep working. We keep working with that lateral movement, turn going from side to side. You're coming up to the halfway marker now. There it is, that's halfway. Again, keep pushing, keep walking, and keep those push-ups nice and low. You've got 10 seconds. You're going forward for the push up you're looking to get that nice low chest to floor and back up you got three seconds two and one good okay so that is burpees again burpees with those 10 star jumps one burpee and then we're doing those 10 star jumps so again burpee into that first one two three and so on let's go let's go let's go one burpee 10 star jumps one burpee 10 star jumps as many sets as possible doing really well guys Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, so commando, so long to short arm plank. Before we do those though, I want those mountain climbers. Okay, so it's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, and then we're gonna do, oh, sorry, we're gonna do one commando. Then we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, two commando. So six mountain climbers and build the commando every round, starting from one upwards. Okay, so six mountain climbers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Down to low plank, up to high plank, or vice versa. Okay, then you're into your second round where you're going to do six and two, six and three, and so on. Again, I'll give you a better uh, demonstration. Six, and then low. And then I should get back into my high mountain climber position. Again, I drive my knees to six repetitions, and then this time it's two. 
And then we'll go six again and higher. Okay, we've only got three seconds. Two and one. Well done. Okay, so it's side touch. So back onto your feet. We're going to do that lateral movement. Again, if you haven't got the room. Oh, sorry, I was trying to mount it. We're going to go one, two. Okay, if you haven't got the room, you can just do your steps forward and back. Okay, so we've got uh, 40 seconds. So you can either do a double shuffle. Otherwise, if the space doesn't allow, you can just do your skaters. Okay, you've got 20 seconds. Again, as many reps as you can, keeping that intensity level up high. We're working about nine to 10 out of 10. Okay, 10 seconds. Three, two, and one. Good, flutter kicks next. Flutter kicks, we're gonna have our backs on the wall. Sorry, backs on the floor, have our hands under the head. We're gonna lift up our shoulders, okay? Legs nice and high. One's gonna come down around two inches off the floor, and then we're gonna to start to work those flutter kicks. Flutter kicks for 40 seconds. From there, up, up. Twenty-five seconds. <clears throat> Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're done. Okay. Sprinting on the spot, so we're going to go in nice and hard for 40 seconds. Nice, fast sprint. Okay. Five, four, three, two, and one. Let's go. Nice and quick with these. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good work. Twenty seconds off. In twenty seconds' time, we're going to do what we did in that first pyramid. We're going to do that one more time through. Okay, so we're going to start with those ten squat thrusts, twenty plank jacks, thirty mountain climbers, forty high knees, finishing with fifty star jumps. So. Squat for us to start with. Let's do one more round. So 10, 10 squat for us. Once you've done 10 squat for us, you're into plank jacks. Plank jacks are 20. So it's one, two, plank jack, legs, and we're going for 20. So the combination so far, 10 squat for us, 20 plank jacks. After you've done them, it's into that mountain climbing position. Quite, uh, quite easy to change. You'll be there anyway from the plank jack. So from there, 30 quick mountain climbers. So those mountain climbers are in and out as quick as you can. Let's get these rounds done as quick as possible. Once you've done your 30 mountain climbers, it's up for your high knees. Okay, 40 of those, 40 high knees. Remember it, to drive those arms and really power those knees as high as possible. Okay, doing awesome guys. Once you've got to the high knees, we are into star jumps. And again, make them nice and big and nice and quick to get that heart rate up for the last time this morning. Okay, well, that's your combination. Squat for us, plank jacks, mountain climbers, high knees, star jumps. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Okay, good stuff guys, keep pushing, keep working. Get those last 150 reps out of this final circuit. Doing awesome. I think we're also on time as well. Yes. Not bad at all. So the star jumps. 
50 of them to take us through to the end. If you get there early, take a drink on and we'll start the stretching off in around a minute's time. So great work guys. Excellent work, so it's all done. Perfect. Okay, so that's uh, the time we've uh, done our stretches. That's gonna give you your 40 minute workout this morning. All body weighted, all stuff you can do at home. Um, and uh, also we've got loads going on today. I think Ben's got a pure tone class later and that's quite a popular class. I think that's about half 10. So check out the Facebook page. Um, and your emails to see what's on the timetable for the rest of the day and week. Also, if you do miss a class, they're all on YouTube, they do get recorded. Um, and it's normally a two or three day delay, but yeah, they will get all, all the classes will get on there over the lockdown period. Okay, so let's stretch you off for having your uh, shoulders stretch first. So taking the arm across the body, looking over to the opposite side. Change. Okay, tricep stretch, take the arm behind, stretch the back of the arm, this muscle here, tricep. Change sides. Okay, back stretch is the big hug out. Okay, so what you're aiming to do is get the chest nice and low. So push the chest to the floor. Feel that stretch through the back. Again, you can do some movement through the neck if you want to look up and down. Just get some movement through the spine. Good, chest. So either your hands on your lower back and squeezing those elbows in tight, or you can do it from the hips as well. Okay, quad stretch. Okay, so we're going to grab the leg behind. Again, just be careful with the balance. Bring the knees together and hold that stretch. Ooh, arms can use to support. Sometimes even doing something random will take the attention off your balance, like holding your ear. And change. Okay, hamstring stretch is where you're going to point the toes up to the ceiling, okay? And you're going to try and get that stretch down the back of the leg. So you're going to push your hips back and you're just going to reach down to that point, okay? So you can go as far as the toe, wherever your flexibility allows you to. We need to hold the stretch, feel it through the hamstring. Again, you can take a nice deep breath in and try and take the stretch a little bit further um, if you wish. So again, doing both hamstrings to so get that first one stretch up. Knee stretch for around 15 seconds or 10, 15 seconds and then you'll change side. So again, it's that hamstring stretch and you're reaching down to touch the toe or a low part of your leg. After you've done both hamstrings, you can go into a calf stretch. Your calf stretch, your forward knee is going to be bent and your back leg is straight. Lean forward while digging your heel of your back leg into the floor and then you'll feel that stretch in that calf at the back there, that's where we're aiming to get. Again, if you need a wall or anything to push against, you can. Change sides. Again, heel down, lean forward, get that stretch in the back calf. Straight leg, calf. And release. We are done, guys.